U.S. President Joe Biden Wednesday signed an executive order requiring the government to assess the risks and benefits of cryptocurrencies and to explore the creation of a digital dollar. The president's order requires the Treasury Department, the Commerce Department, and other key agencies to prepare reports on the future of money. It's a first step toward coordinated government regulation of the now $3 trillion industry. Administration officials said oversight of the booming sector is essential to ensure U.S. national security, financial stability, and to fend off the growing threat of cybercrime. What we have today is incredibly thoughtful. Kristen Smith, executive director of the Blockchain Association, says the industry welcomes the approach. What we want is a measured, methodical approach to analyzing this space. What we don't want are rushed policies that are pushed through last minute without open discussion. And in order to get a a menu of policy solutions to consider, you really have to start with the type of analysis that this executive order is asking for today. So I think, I think, you know, the asset class is at a valuation that merits this, this, this type of investigation. Um, it's, it's not too late. Um, it's, it's also not too early. I think. White House officials said the U.S. was taking great care to decide whether and how to move forward with a U.S. central bank digital currency, or CBDC. According to the Atlantic Council, nine countries have launched central bank digital currencies, and 16 others, including China, have begun development of such digital assets, leading some in Washington to worry that the dollar could lose some of its dominance to China. Bitcoin surged on the news of the executive order, calming market fears of an immediate crackdown on cryptocurrencies.